I'm back. Today I'm bringing you a preview of one of my guitars. This is a new model. Uh, right now I give every guitar a code name. Uh, so this was code named Dragon when I was making it. I don't know why, just this is what worked for me. Uh, so this body shape is my Dragon shape. Um, it is, this one is a prototype. It was made for me actually, but uh, Davy Klein Jr. decided he really wanted it. So we went ahead and made it his guitar and changed it to his specs. So this is a uh, purple rain finish. This is a bunch of purple uh, sparkles, a lot of sparkle with uh, purple candy over the top of the sparkle, just because why not? Uh, so this guitar weighs in at about seven and a half pounds, is made of northern poplar, which surprisingly is a lot heavier than southern poplar. Uh, it's white, it's clean, it doesn't have any green streaks, but it does weigh a ton. So this, you know, it's a little lighter than Les Paul, but it's got a good weight to it. Uh, what we did with this one is we put on a Goto 1996 Floyd Rose style. <laughs> So it dive bombs, does all that good stuff. Uh, we have a DiMarzio Tone Zone, a DiMarzio Mojo. This is a Jackson style neck, you know, like the inlays. Uh, but the headstock is more of a, I don't know, Robin meets something else. Just kind of what I had at the time. Uh, this is what I created with what I had. Uh, didn't spend a whole lot of time besides just said, hey, let me make it look cool. Uh, things I did is I did a lot of carving on this, as you might be able to see. Just just a lot of carving, took away a lot of material. I uh, tried to make a nice tummy cut, took some out of the back. So you can stick your hand really far in there. It's got Dunlop sunken strap locks. You know, got them on there, it's all good. Uh, so I'm just gonna jam it a little bit. Other thing I did is I did a push-pull coil tap. So you have your standard. Or you can coil tap it. And it gets pretty uh, single coily. I don't know. It gets spanky. It, it's pretty good. Uh, so um, here's just a little few riffing with it. that all up but pedal see what it sounds like <laughs> this mojo it has a certain amount of mojo to it so not right tone zone baby <laughs> let's check out some clean sounds Both. 
coil tapped. Back. Nick. Both. I dig it, man. So uh, this is my one and only playthrough. I, I assembled it before we painted it and um, did a kind of a little quick riff through just to make sure everything put together well. Uh, but this is really my first time to really get to play through it and check it out. Uh, so I'm gonna be sad to see this puppy go because um, man, it's everything I would have wanted in a shred guitar Plus, it, it lets me have a lot of cool single coil tones that I didn't think I was going to be able to get out of this type of guitar. Uh, so I'm going to try building something like this again. I'm going to try a few different things and just see how it comes out. But for now, here's to you, Davey.